We are getting back on a catamaran and leading a flotilla of eight boats and more than 50 of our patrons on a tour through the BVI. The British Virgin Islands are one of the best places to sail. In this video, we're going to get off the dock and sail to Norman Island, which is home to the world famous Willie Tees. It's always a rowdy time on the William Thornton. Well, we're breaking up. No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. We're not. We are. No, we're not. She has to go Getting home. Divorced. No, no, no. She has to go home. <laughs> she has to go home and take care of some family stuff. Yeah. So I'm unfortunately not able to come to the BBI. Yeah. So I'm packing up to go to the BBI. She's packing up to go home for a bit. But yeah. We'll be but back here in a couple weeks. Have the best time on the flotilla. I will. Sorry, you're not going to make it. I know. It's okay, though. I have some family stuff and that is always important. Yep. Got to take care of family first. So. Yeah. Alrighty. After three flights and a ferry, I made it to Nanny Key on Tortola, which is home of the Navigar Yachting Charter Base. It's a great place to start your sail cruising the BVI. Nanny Key is a pretty large marina, and the Navigar base takes up most of the dock space. All right, so this is the Navigar office, the new stuff. I'm probably gonna freak them all out because they don't want to be on camera. But let me introduce you to the crew. Uh oh, how's it going, guys? No, these guys are great. The crew here has all been really great. So thanks for helping us out today. Welcome back. All right, all right, thank you. What's up, man? Man, how are you? <laughs> Guys, we're back. Hey, all together again. Finally. True. And then, of course, our cameraman back there. Oh, yeah. Hey, Bryce. <laughs> it's, it's a bummer. Bummer Steph couldn't be here this week. Yeah, but. we're going to miss her yes. and we're going to have extra fun in her honor. Yeah, that's right. There and we have to do the anchor for her. Yeah. Yeah. Really, really good. So, all right, we are in the BVI. We're leading a flotilla with Navigar. Uh, more, more information on Navigar later, but that's who the, the charter company is. We got all these boats. We have eight boats all cruising around together. It's a lot of fun. And so right now we are going to go meet up with all the, the cruisers that we're going with. I don't know how many are here yet, but we're going to have a little briefing for everybody and then we're going to get off the dock. Woo! You ready? Do it. Good. I have some very uh, VIPs to introduce you to here. It is the winner of our patron drawing, Kevin and Sabrina. Yay! <laughs> so uh, tell me a little bit about yourselves, uh, where you're from, what's going on? Uh, we live in a combination of Indiana and Florida, so we spend our winters in Florida, obviously, and commute back to our hometowns in Indiana for the balance of the summer. Yeah. All right. You done any sailing before? Been out? On uh, watch? I, I had been on one trip in the BVI. Okay. This, this is her virgin trip. First out time. On, all right. Catamaran. Well, it's going to be great. We're going to have a lot of fun. I mean, hold that thing up. Uh, we're gonna have a lot of fun. Uh, thanks for you know what you've been a patron for like two years or something, right? Yes. Yeah. So yes. Well, thanks for being a patron. Thanks for coming out. Absolutely. And are you really? excited about this? I'm very excited. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Did you get seasick? Uh, I don't know. You don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Well, hopefully not. I'm prepared. All right. Well, we got a couple more things to do here, and then we're gonna get off the dock. You guys ready? We are ready. All right. So this is all the Navigar. Everything you see over here is all Navigar. It's their boats. These are other crew. They're getting ready to go. These are other people coming with us on the flotilla. But they have a bunch of different cats and. Well, mostly cats here, but I'm sure you can get a monohull if you'd like. But uh, yeah, so we're gonna head over and meet everybody right now. Yeah, I'm in Charlotte, but I'm from Richmond, Virginia. Oh, cool. That's right, you're a Cowboys fan too. You're yeah. from Richmond, yeah. Virginia, and you're a Cowboys I didn't have fan? To Thank you, everybody, for coming to the Salem Noodles Flotilla. Woo! And so, uh, so a lot of you guys, I mean, so when we announced this, I mean, pretty much everybody, most everybody that was there in the Bahamas already rebooked, so it's good to see all you guys back. And uh, so this one sold out pretty quick. Thanks, Navigar, for putting it all together. So as they get you cleared to go, you can go if you'd like. We're going to, we got a couple little more things to do. We'll be probably another hour before we're, we're ready to get off the dock. And the plan for the day is to sail right over to Norman Island. It's uh, looking a little sporty out there. We're just going to put our head sail up and go. We'll probably, I mean, it's 15, at least 15, 18 knots out there right now. We're just going to put our head sail up and, and sail downwind to Norman Island. We're just going to cook on our boat and either do happy hour or late night at Willie T's, maybe both. Uh, if you don't know Willie T's, you'll, you'll learn about that soon enough. Uh, it's, it's, 
it's a lot of fun. So any questions or concerns or anything? When's the next one? Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone was excited to get going, so we headed back to the boats. With a little help from the guys at Navigar, we got off the dock. wind conditions here? It's actually not too bad, honestly. I mean, we got, well, 12, 13 knots of wind. That's pretty good, actually. It's not too much. So we can sail. Yeah. We have no annoying dinghy in the bag. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> That's yeah. so good. Oh, yeah, it's waving. Oh, my God. It was a short hop and perfect conditions for sailing downwind on just the headsail. You don't want to talk anymore. I want to get so numb, want to get so numb while we enemies. No, you don't mind the way I said my words. Mm, you know exactly what it After about 45 minutes, it was time to furl the headsail, start the motors, and head into the bay. Uh, once we get closer right there, I'm going to walk up and talk you through how to do everything. end of it goes through the little hole, yep. back through on the outside, tied onto the cleat. I'll be here to cheer for you guys. Yes. You, I believe in you. Okay. Teamwork. <laughs> the crew did a great job catching the mooring on the first try. This is the 2020 42-foot Fontaine Peugeot we'll be sailing for the week. I'll give you a proper tour of it in the next video. The Bight, as it's known on Norman's Island, is a huge and very deep bay filled with at least 100 mooring balls. The center of the Bight is too deep to anchor, but it is possible around the edges. Tucked in the corner is the floating bar and restaurant known as Willie T's. It's tradition to jump off the top deck. This is the third iteration of Willie T's after the first two were destroyed in hurricanes. On a bit more upscale meal, you can head to the Pirate's Bite. of our eight boat flotilla arrived to catch their moorings. Yeah.
All right, guys. So first night out on the boat. Woo! Glad to have everybody here. Thanks for coming, Kevin. Cheers. Absolutely. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers on the mustard. It's all right. Mm. All right. Burgers, fresh made on the grill, and then we're gonna go over to Willie T's later, and uh, shenanigans ensue. Sorry if the video and audio sucks. We're taking the GoPro because we're going to uh, Willie T's, and debauchery may ensue. And uh, don't want to like mess up an expensive camera. It's not that this one is cheap, but you know it is what it is. So. We're heading to Willie T's. You guys ready? Yeah. Willa P is ready for Willie T's. Willa P. All right. Let's do it. How about yourself? Ready to go. All right. Willie T's is a fun place to be any time of day or night, and the parties tend to build quickly. And of course, the adult beverages tend to liven things up as well. on the boats in the BVI. If you'd like to come down, you can check out Navigar Yachting. They're the ones that supplied the boats for this whole thing, so thank you so much to those guys. And I've worked with them in the past. They have like 13 different bases all over the world. Uh, so if you want a charter, you can do that. There is a coupon code. If you use coupon DOODLE at checkout, you'll get a couple hundred dollars off your booking. And also, uh, they do yacht sales. So if you wanted to like buy one of these and put it in the charter fleet, they have all kinds of like financing options. And then you get end up getting like free weeks on the year on all that. You can contact them for more information about it. If you do contact them, I'd appreciate it if you would say you saw it on Sailing Doodles. So thank you uh, guys for watching. Thank you to Navigar for uh, supplying the boats.